Hi there, everybody. We're going to be talking about co-integration, pair trading potential, uh, namely in the world of Forex. I'm going to give you a quick synopsis. Uh, I strongly recommend you to watch the Crypto one, uh, as that one's a little more precise. And uh, you can definitely learn more from that video under a cryptocurrency for pair trading and co-integration. So this particular... Um, set of uh, files uh, right now I'm just going to show you what we have um, I will be adding more files um, but they will be similar to what you find under the cryptocurrency so the difference between crypto and the difference between crypto and Forex is that the patterns for co-integration hold a lot better for instance this one's been on on for about oh, 10 days at least since I discovered it and usually uh, it holds for a very long time so this is a great pair trade to work with for both the long and the short so in this case what we do thanks to the Oando uh, broker API here <coughs> excuse me um, what we can do is we can look at any particular pair that we have access to via the uh, Orlando order book and we can measure the amount of uh, positions for that pair that have shorts and how many percent are long so obviously the ones are long chances are the price will drive, be driven up and then shorts are when the prices are driven down so in this case as I said this pair has been a very good pair uh, to trade so long in this case is the euro British pound and the, and the short British pound against the uh, Swiss franc. So when you look at uh, the charts that are generated uh, here in the moving average and co-integration, um, here uh, what we're looking at is the spread between the closing price for a certain period of time. And you can see it's just been a steady uh, incline which is good including uh, as I said that's the price ratio difference between the two on top of the moving average and of a slow period and a slow a fast slow moving average period so we can see that here also we have the Z score and again you want to watch the cryptocurrency pair trading where I, I better describe the Z score um, but essentially it's in the, this range here where we have the standard deviation of zero, or sorry, the mean being at zero, and then the standard deviation of one, positive one and negative one, and anything outside that are opportunities to trade. So I uh, just wanted to let you know that, uh, how this works, but you'll get better idea if you, as I said, go under the cryptocurrency Forex pair trading uh, set of videos to get a better handle on how this works. And that, that's pretty well it. We shall talk to you later.